which is our new single, and we are going to move on. And this is a song of the first album, very upbeat R&B dancey, this one's called Make It. Yes.
Tyrant, that was off the first album. Um, as you know, if you have got the album, it was a bit of an experiment, to be honest, between me and Mark. It was like, we're just going to go for it. So as you can tell, there was an R&B trap, a uh, singer, songwriter trap, piano trap, reggae. pop rock, reggae, blah, blah, blah. It was everything on the, uh, on the album, hence why it was called Different. But, yeah. Hello. You okay? <laughs> How's everyone? Yeah. You're certainly here. If anybody is out shopping, Christmas shopping, get coming, come on. Get <laughs> Right, don't forget, um, I have hoodies, CDs, cups and stuff on sale. My beautiful man is on the merch stand, where is she? Where's my man, where's she what? Oh, Julie! Oh, there she is, there, what are you doing there? Get back behind your soul. <laughs> come on! <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. So there we are, my wonderful, beautiful man who's been through everything with me, bringing us up and uh, getting me to where I am today, is selling stuff. So, yeah, if you want to go and have a chat with my mum, she's just in the corner, with Elaine as well. Where's Elaine? Is Elaine there? My mum's amazing friend as well, absolutely amazing woman. So, check out Cubs Hoodies, winter time guys, get your hoodies, it's getting cold. Hot in here! We've got one, we've got two. <laughs> it's good to see them as well, like, this is so real, like, it's just like... Yeah, I've... Is she? Oh, there she is, yeah. There's people in. My sister's come, my little nephew's in the front. My brother's there, big Steven's there. We're in. Right, um, yeah, I'm just going to talk for just two more minutes just to get this out off my chest. Since I was singing and wanting to do this, it's very cheesy. I've said this before if you've watched Facebook and the Instagram story. This has been a massive dream of mine, and because of Richie, this dream has come true. Not only is my CD on sale, um, but we managed to get a set. Like, I'm playing the original music in HMV, I can't believe it. Literally can't believe it. Unbelievable. Me and this man's been working hard for about seven years, non-stop, every week in the studio. And uh, we've done a bit, haven't we? It's kind of and it, it has, in, in, in a good way, though, in a good way, we've done a lot. Mark Pattinson's came on board playing guitar, uh, just bringing different ideas, different sound to the table. And I worked for Mark Thurtle last year, um, the year before Mark was my drummer in the band. Unfortunately, we had a bit of an accident with my drummer Paul. Um, he broke his fingers and as a drummer, his hand, he couldn't play. So I just want to give a massive thank you and appreciation to Mark Thurtle for stepping in on drums again. Also. Right, let's talk and more singing, yeah? Yeah! This song is not the first album. I know it was somebody's favourite who was in. Stephen, I think you said you liked it. This one, she ticks all boxes. Here we go. She makes me 
Honestly, I absolutely live for these sort of gigs. Like, me and the band, for money reasons and stuff, we get about, we do a lot of cover gigs, as you need to make money. But this is what I, this is what I want to do, this is what I live for. So more shows like this, we're going to sort out a bit of a tour next year as well, so we're going to make that happen, alright? Yeah, we'll jump on board, we'll get a bus, we'll get a bus for and take this all over, right? Let's see, throw seats. Right. Right then, so we're going to slow things down for one, if that's alright. I'm looking for the blue mark and I think I'm in the middle, but I'm not, I don't care. Right, so um, a bit of a change of plan really for this song. Um, probably for the first time only. Um, I had some really bad news on Sunday, Monday, yeah. Um, Sunday I had some really bad news. Um, if anyone had seen my social media, you would have seen that one of my one of my good friends from school um, sadly passed away. Um, Nathan B B B in the dancing machine. Um, he commented just three days before he passed away, saying that he was coming and he was excited. He always used to message us. I never used to see him as much as I wanted to, but you know we've got other things going on in life and yeah. Ooh. I'm a bit upset that I didn't get the photo see him when I should have, but um, for the first time tonight, as well as this song, it's for my cousin Stephen who I wrote it for, I'm going to dedicate this song for Julie, yeah, and his girlfriends came along as well, and yeah, Nathan Bean's here somewhere, so let's enjoy this guys, let's enjoy um, this song for Nathan, um, this is I Can Feel You My Son. Uh, just before we get Is it right? Is it 
Yeah, I can feel it. It's yeah, like whoa, shivers. Woo! Where's the ass? Right, so, you're going to do a cool one now, yeah? Yeah. Right, we're going to do a cool one. Ready, want to just come with all the original stuff, but um, we're going to keep it the same vibe. And at the minute I've been enjoying this song, and you want to find a Lewis Capaldi? Yeah! 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 Y
Love this. Right then, so next up, we're back to the first album. Yes. And um, this song, just a bit of a background very quickly. Um, you've heard of the band called The Script, right? Yeah. Yeah? I don't think I've ever told you this, huh? Right. For yeah, yeah, you. We know you love Danny, we know you love The Script, as you should, because they're great. But listen, um, when I was on X Factor, I had a drink because my mouth is so dry, two seconds, right? I'm shaking, yeah, what's up? What's going on? Yeah, right, so. X Factor 2014, I had to go down the Baltic and do the room audition. And what happened was, Danny, uh, his management and stuff, the script were playing at the arena on the same day. And the script were actually at the Baltic in the back scenes, obviously to get backstage passes, access all areas, as you would if you had the script. And they got to watch the auditions. And I sang Better Man in my room audition. And I went through boot camp and the arena audition, the chair challenge, as you know, if you follow what I, what, why I'm doing this and why we're probably here. But, um, yeah, Danny from the script had told the ex producer of X Factor that he actually wanted to buy this song office. He wanted to buy Better Man. And uh, it was a bit surreal at the time. But I think because I had already done it in the room audition and it was already on an album, it made it very tough, very hard for them to take it on and redo things. So that didn't happen. But I have that always to tell the story. So this song could have easily been a song by the script. So, we're going to do it now. This is my song. This one's called Better Man. Yes! <laughs> Thank you. 
Song, but they're not getting it because it's mine. Yeah. <laughs> who knows? One day, who knows? Right? So, guys, we have a new song in the set tonight. Exclusive tonight. This song nobody's heard before, and we haven't released it yet. But we are planning on doing it after the year. It's a brand new song. Yeah, we're just gonna go for it. Let's see how this goes, guys. Right? This song is called "Enough Is Enough," and I hope you enjoy it. Guys, that song is not out yet, so we thought we'd bring a bit of a surprise today. So there we are. Enough is enough. We're looking to release that early next year, maybe. We'll see how it goes, but um, yeah, that felt good. New song. Nice. Right, we're gonna. Yeah. Right. So this one, bit of a reggae song. Anyone? Anyone have a bit of reggae? A bit of movie? Let's dance, yeah. This one is called See the Light.
Songs. I don't know what's next. <laughs> yeah, we're going to do that one. Right, guys, so this song, we don't really do. We haven't got the chance to do it, but with this being a super great original gig, we're going to do it. We're going to do it. We do it great. <laughs> um, so the EP we released back in late 2015. Wow. Um, I wrote a song called Say My Name. <laughs> so we're going to.